Ever felt the weight of the world on your shoulders? Imagine if you could lighten that load and transform your body by doing something as simple as hanging. Yes, you heard it right, hanging. A mere two minutes of your day devoted to this straightforward exercise can yield surprising results. Over the next 10 minutes, we'll delve into the science behind the transformative power of hanging. We'll explore how it decreases pain, increases muscle strength, and improves posture. We'll also discuss how it aids in shoulder injury recovery and a host of other miscellaneous benefits that might have you swinging from the rafters. So if you're looking to make a small change with big impact, stick around. This could be the easiest yet most effective addition to your fitness regimen. Remember, two minutes a day may just be the small change you need for big results. Imagine a life where shoulder and back pain doesn't reign supreme. How liberating would it be to break free from the constraints of perpetual discomfort, to feel the weight lifting from your shoulders and back? Well, with a simple hanging exercise, this could become your reality. Hanging offers an effective way to decrease body pain, particularly in the shoulders and back. How? It all boils down to the principle of spinal decompression. When we hang, our body weight naturally stretches the spine, allowing the intervertebral discs to expand, relieving pressure and tension in the process. This is a game changer for those of us who spend hours hunched over a computer or lifting heavy weights. Now, you might be wondering, how does this relate to shoulder pain? It's simple. Your shoulders are closely linked to your spine and any tension in your back can radiate through these joints. By decompressing your spine through hanging, you can alleviate some of this shoulder tension, resulting in less pain. And it's not just about pain relief. This decompression effect also promotes better circulation around your spine and shoulders. With improved blood flow, your body can more effectively heal and repair any micro damage in these areas, further reducing discomfort over time. But don't just take our word for it, the proof is in the science. A study published in the Archives of Physical Medicine and Rehabilitation found that a group of individuals who performed hanging exercises for two weeks reported a significant reduction in neck and shoulder pain compared to a control group. Remember though, consistency is key. Just like any other exercise, the benefits of hanging won't magically appear after one session, but with dedication, just two minutes a day for 30 days, you can start to experience these pain relieving effects. So, next time you're feeling the strain, remember that relief could be just a hang away. Who doesn't want to be stronger? Strength is not just about lifting heavy weights or showing off bulging biceps. It's about empowering your body to perform everyday tasks with ease. And guess what? Hanging can help you achieve just that. Now you might be wondering, how can simply hanging off a bar boost your strength? Well, it's all about the muscles you're engaging. When you're hanging, your upper body, including your arms, shoulders, and back, is doing all the work to keep you suspended. This isometric exercise, where you're holding a position without moving, engages multiple muscles simultaneously, leading to increased strength over time. Think about it this way. When you're hanging, your hands are gripping the bar tightly. This simple act engages your forearm muscles. Your arms and shoulders, straining to keep your body aloft, are getting a workout. And your back muscles? They're working overtime to stabilize your body and maintain your position. This comprehensive upper body engagement can improve your overall fitness. It can make you better at other exercises too. Those pull-ups that have always seemed impossible? With increased arm and shoulder strength from hanging? You might find them within your reach. That tricky yoga pose that requires upper body strength? It could become easier as well. And the best part is you don't need to be a gym junkie or a fitness expert to start hanging. It's a simple, accessible exercise that anyone can incorporate into their daily routine. Whether you're a seasoned athlete looking to enhance your performance or someone just starting out on your fitness journey, hanging can offer strength benefits. So next time you see a pull-up bar, don't just walk past it. Take a moment, reach up, and hang. Let your muscles do the work. Feel the burn. Embrace the challenge. And over time, you might just find yourself becoming stronger. Hanging might just be the strength training you've been missing. So why not give it a shot? Two minutes a day could lead to a stronger, healthier, more empowered you. Sit up straight as we dive into how hanging can better your posture. Now, posture isn't just about looking confident and poised. It's about the health of your spine, the alignment of your body, and the strength of your muscles. When you hang, you're giving the muscles that support your spine a serious workout. You're strengthening your back, your shoulders, and your core, all of which are integral to maintaining good posture. And 
you're doing it in a way that's easy on your joints, which is a big plus. But there's more. As you hang, your spine decompresses, relieving tension and aligning your body naturally. Over time, this can lead to a more upright stance, less back pain, and a stronger core. So, the next time you're slouching at your desk, remember the power of the hang, forget the posture corrector, try hanging instead. Shoulder injuries can be a pain, but hanging may just be the solution you're looking for. When it comes to shoulder injuries, one common issue we face is a lack of mobility and increased stiffness. This is where the magic of hanging comes into play. By simply allowing our bodies to hang, we create an environment where the shoulder joint can begin to heal and regain its natural range of motion. Let's delve a bit deeper. Our shoulder joint, or the glenohumeral joint, is one of the most complex in our body. It's a ball and socket joint that allows for a wide range of movement. But with this complexity comes a susceptibility to injury. That's where hanging can be a game changer. When we hang, we're essentially using our body weight to create a gentle yet effective stretch across the shoulder joint. This stretch helps to decompress the joint, reducing inflammation and promoting healing. It's like giving your shoulders a mini massage every day. Not only that, but it can also help to realign the shoulder joint, which can be particularly beneficial if you've suffered a dislocation. But it's not just about physical benefits, there's a psychological aspect too. Hanging can provide a sense of relief as it's a passive exercise that doesn't require much effort. It's a moment of calm in your day, which can be extremely beneficial in managing the stress that often comes with injury. Remember, consistency is key. Just two minutes a day for 30 days can make a significant difference. Start slow and listen to your body. If you feel discomfort, lower the duration or frequency. It's not about pushing through pain, it's about facilitating healing. And of course, it's always best to consult with a healthcare professional before starting any new exercise regimen, especially if you're recovering from an injury. They can provide guidance based on your unique situation and ensure you're doing what's best for your body. Don't let shoulder injuries hold you back, give hanging a try. If you're not convinced yet, here are a few more reasons to start hanging. These benefits are like the cherry on top, the added bonuses you didn't even realize you were signing up for when you started this two-minute daily routine. First up, improved grip strength. Whether you're opening a stubborn jar or climbing a mountain, a strong grip is essential. Hanging from a bar is one of the most effective ways to boost that grip power. Next, increased flexibility. The act of hanging can gently stretch your muscles and joints, leading to increased flexibility over time. This can make everyday tasks easier and can even improve your performance in other sports and activities. And finally, let's not forget about the mental benefits. Hanging can be a form of meditation, helping to clear your mind and relieve stress. The benefits of hanging extend far beyond what meets the eye. Still have questions about hanging? Let's tackle some of the most common ones. Some folks wonder, won't hanging be tough on my joints? Well, it's actually quite the opposite. Done properly, hanging can help decompress the spine and relieve joint stress. Another common question is, do I need a fancy gym setup to hang? Not at all. A sturdy tree branch or a home pull-up bar will do just fine. Now some of you might be thinking, I can't even hang for 10 seconds, how am I supposed to do 2 minutes? Remember, it's not about hanging for 2 minutes straight. Break it up into manageable chunks. Start with 10 seconds, then 20, then 30, and so on. The most important thing is to listen to your body and progress at your own pace. We encourage you to give it a try and share your experiences. Remember, good things come to those who hang.